items in the church is a, is an offense or is sinful or is not good. And let's even let me agree that is actually a way of merchandising the gospel. Then, in your own definition, what is spiritual items? Anything that carries the emblem of Christ and in the name of Christ, then we now start selling it. Or, what I mean, somebody is trying to spiritualize this thing. Maybe somebody takes this mantle and says, I blessed it and this is a spiritual item. So, is selling of your books a spiritual item? Yes. Is selling of your jotters, man of God. I'm talking to those who are teachers and what base. Because you see, let's try to balance this. You sell your jotters in the church? Yes. Don't lie. I know. You sell your stickers in the church? Yes. You sell your books in the church? Yes. <laughs> there are many things you sell. You sell the pen that carries your pictures. What best preacher? You sell it in the church? Yes. You sell your magazines in the church? Yes. You sell your calendars in the church? Yes. You sell water by prophets? Yes. Okay. Uh, you sell all other spiritual items that you want to mention. And oil in the church. And mantle in the church. Why are we so particular about the oil, the water, and the, and the mantle that is done by prophets? Can we not talk? So do you think, do you think that selling of books is not a spiritual item? Please, I, 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 I want to. Maybe I, I stand to be corrected. Is selling of books not spiritual item? Is selling of books not spiritual item? <laughs> Is selling of books not spiritual item? Selling of stickers not spiritual item? Selling of calendars is not spiritual items? Selling of jotters is not spiritual items? Selling of your pen is not spiritual items? Is it not? Is it not a spiritual item? Why are you so particular about the oil and the water and the mantle for prophets alone? We are all guilty if you want to put it that way. Why is fry pan calling Ketu black? I stand to challenge all churches and any pastor anywhere all over. You that teach against just holy prophet. I, I, I'm agreeing with you if you say it's wrong. But can we just talk? What is the definition of spiritual item? What is the definition of spiritual item? If your books are not spiritual item, oh, your sticker are not spiritual item. The calendars of the church are not spiritual item. I know you want to tell me now, no, 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 we are not saying You know you are lying because you sell them. Oh, why do you have bookshops? Most of you are criticizing. Go to all your ministry. There is a bookshop in your ministry. There is a bookshop where you sell your materials. Why are you making this thing of calling prophets? Oh, why is fry pan calling K2 black? If you say all oh, prophets are guilty of it, you are guilty of it. That's what I'm saying. This selective holiness and criticism is one of the reasons why the body of Christ is down. Maybe you say prophets are doing their own in an high scale, isn't it? All sin are sin. There is no low sin. There's no lie sin. In the scale of sin to sin, if there is what we call sintometer, a meter to measure sin, it is 100% weighing sin as sin. Sir, ma, I am tired of this hypocrisy. You can attack me if you feel like attacking me. That's no problem. Uh, if you say guilty as charged, fine. But what does it mean to sell spiritual material? Selling a book is not spiritual material. I know you will tell me, uh, I pay the printer, we buy the papers, we buy the district, we buy that. That's how the prophet to buy what he buys to package. <laughs> what is the definition of selling of spiritual material? The sticker is not spiritual material. Uh, what based churches and you who call yourself a teacher of righteousness, you sell your stickers, you sell your books, 
You sell everything. You sell, you sell. You even have a you even have a pure water company where you sell your 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 water. Eh, oh, oh the, you said the prophet is selling water, isn't it? But you sell your water and you put the name of the ministry as an emblem, and your members rush the water, isn't it? They rush it. They rush it. It's not a spiritual item. It's not a spiritual, but the mantle is sold by the prophet. Now I'm trying to say that if you are condemning people, condemn including yourself let me ask you let me ask you as you listen to me as you talk about selling of spiritual items you know let's be very very sincere apostle they invite you teacher they invite you to go to uk london to go to south africa to go to other countries to preach you ask them for first class ticket including your entourage you are not merchandising you are a very spiritual man you ask them to put you in a first class hotel in fact you specify the hotel where you will stay the holy spirit didn't speak to you at that time <laughs> you even tell them the brand of car that come to pick you in the airport you're not merchandising but you are quick at condemning pastors. <laughs> and when they ask you, you say that that's the only way we can sponsor the gospel. The Holy Spirit doesn't speak to you. But when it comes to prophet, you speak against them. So I'm talking to you. I'm talking to you. I'm talking to you. We know what you do and how you do it. So let's be sincere. You sell your sticker. You sell your calendars for the year. You sell the pen and you put your name on it. <laughs> you have a bookshop in the church where you sell so many things. In fact, you have <laughs> you, you have everything there. When they invite you, a post to holiness and a teacher righteousness, you give them the Kind of flight you enter, you tell them I fly first class. They buy you the ticket. You're not merchandising the gospel. You are preaching free. Why don't you buy your ticket for yourself? Why are you pushing them to buy the ticket? You ask them to put you in a first class hotel, including your personal PA. Why are you allowing them to put you in a first? Why don't you stay in the pastor's house? Why don't you even help the young ministry? I'm just I'm just reasoning with you. You know, you call others sinners, but I, I'm reasoning with you. Oh, you don't think you are merchandising at that time. So, I'm saying this, that we are in a generation where people are trying to make men who have value to lose their value. You ask for an aerarium. You tell them, I'm not charging you an aerarium. But you ask. For the love, you see some gospel artists in court who sing in the name of right. You sing that they even come down. But you cannot go to that church to sing that song if you are not, if you have not charged them 5 million, 10 million, 3 million, 7 million, 15 million naira. You are bringing down the glory down, but you actually collected more than 10, 15 million. Who is actually merchandising? You are a big sing. I'm not against you being honored. But I'm asking. You sing powerful songs and people cry. But before you came, they paid you in advance 5 million naira just to attend to sing. I'm asking. Are you actually merchandising? Why are we just so crazy about prophets alone? Remove the beam in your eyes before you remove the beam in other people's eyes. If there must be clean and righteousness, can we start from you? Can we? Can you come and sing, sir, ma, gospel actors, minister, opposed to holiness and opposed to righteousness, teacher, rightly dividing the world? Can I ask, can you come to preach without collecting a dime and pay your hotel bills yourself, pay your flight bills yourself and come in? Let us know you're actually freely preaching the gospel and freely you receive.